people. If you've been watching my videos, by now you know that I'm on an iris buzz at the minute. And this is my update review on Mason VLA's Tanagra. Stay tuned, people, if you're interested to find out about this fragrance. What is good YouTube? Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to my channel. My name is Mike, Michael, Mikey Cologne and if you tuned in, thank you for doing so people. Right, you see the intro. I need to talk to you about Tanagra by Maison VLA. I'm going to read you the notes and I'm just going to talk to you about the fragrance a little bit. But straight off the bat, I'm going to tell you that this is a soft, feminine leaning fragrance. There is nothing masculine about this whatsoever i just wanted to put that out there before i started the spray a little bit and then i'll tell you the notes right in the top you've got tangerine pear freesia in the mid you've got peony jasmine and iris and in the base you've got musk vetiver and cedar this opens floral fruity a tad soapy you've got that freesia and that iris is giving this fragrance little powdery touches. And then you've got the musk. This is so light on the musk. It is there, but it is so light. And then you, I get little nuances of that cedar. I do not get any vetiver to my nose. I can't detect that. But the florals I get, it's a bit fruity. The pear in this is gorgeous. It really is. But... Fellas, if you're watching this, this is a feminine leaning fragrance. That doesn't bother me. If I like a fragrance, I'm going to wear it. But the only thing that does bother me is the performance on this. And I'll get to that in a second. So it's fruity, floral, a tad soapy, minutely musky. You get the iris. It's a little bit powdery. And that is basically the fragrance in a nutshell. There is not a lot that changes. It's a quite linear fragrance. Right, let's get on to the performance. The performance is absolutely shocking. For 75ml bottle, it's £135 in the UK. And this is nothing against the brand. I think that is ridiculous. I have to tell you the truth. Me being a reviewer of fragrances, I'm not going to sit here and start lying. No, I need to tell you how it's gonna how it performs on my skin. And I got someone else to wear this fragrance and it performed exactly the same. Moderate projection for 20 to 30 minutes, then it's a skin scent, and I didn't even get all the times that I've worn it. Look, I think I've worn about five mil of that eight mil sample. All the times that I've worn it, I ain't even got three hours out of the fragrance. Like, literally, it's gone off my skin. And I've worn it a few times now. I've worn it around during the day. I've worn it to bed. I've worn it fresh out of the shower. It doesn't last. And for the price that they want for this fragrance, I've got to say, I think it's ridiculous. I think if you're going to spend £135 of your hard-earned money, I think you deserve a fragrance that is going to perform. Not one that is going to underperform. So like I say, the performance isn't there at all. If I was to get this fragrance, I would wear it on summer days because there would be no way, like even the scent profile ain't really fit for winter, but this wouldn't last at all. So I would wear this on a summer day. Like I say, it does lean quite feminine, but I like iris. The pear note in there is nice, little bits of musk. That is nice. Overall, the scent profile, I enjoy. But what I don't enjoy is the longevity of it. It is terrible. It really, really is. And I had high hopes. When I first sprayed this on, I thought it's a bit soft, but I like the scent profile. So that was a good start. Then, when it started to dissipate and not project at all, I thought to myself, it just ain't worth the coin. 
it really, really isn't. Right, people, let me know if you've tried this fragrance. Let me know what your thoughts are on it. Is it just my skin? But like I say, I did get someone else to test it out and it acted the same on their skin as it did my skin. So, but thank you for sticking with me, people. Remember, smelling good's always a pleasure and never a chore. And I will definitely see you on the next one. Cheers for your time.